Something interesting happened uh, early this week. The NLO actually signed a new multi-million multi contract with a new title sponsor. But one other contract that was also embedded in that was a, was a, uh, a partnership with a company called Nemo Sports. Now, if you think of Opta Sports, Nemo Sports are like the Nigerian version of Opta Sports. And joining us tonight uh, is the founder of Nemo Sports, Namdi Emefo, uh, is online. Thank you so much, Namdi. It's an absolute pleasure to have you on the show. Now, could you tell us a bit more about this partnership with, N with the NLO? A lot of people don't really understand what it entails. Could you just break it down for us? What exactly is Nemo Sports and what is this partnership with the NLO? Yeah, thank you. It's a pleasure to be on the show. So, yeah, basically, uh, think of like a football match, right? If you give Nemo Sports a football match, we process it and we spit out data analytics with videos, right? So basically, for every single pass, we show you the video. For every dribble, for every single thing being, on, being done in the game, we show the video. So we would be doing this for all the NLO matches, right? So with this, NLO and all their partners and all the scouts who are interested in, you know, the best players out of NLO, they could be able to know, look, this guy has the best line break passes. This guy has the best dribbles. This guy has the best, you know, headers. Clarence right? his tackles. So, mm. so this improves the level of scouting, right? Mm. So you don't even have to fly down to Nigeria to find the next Osimen, right? Mm. You can but, just but, be in your house, log on to the platform, and see who has the best 1v1 goals. Who but, has the best but, but now the, there are those who are wondering why 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 starting at the third the third tier of Nigeria football why not the MPFL where supposedly the best players play? Well, um, the the NLO so far have been the center for the grassroots, right? So we believe that we need to start from the grassroots because we even want the likes of Aimba Rangers to also use our platforms to scout from the grassroots as well, right? So that's why uh, we started with that focus from the grassroots. Okay, very quickly, finally, how, how does this partnership benefit the NLO itself, the clubs in the NLO? We have as much, they have as many as 344 clubs. How does this benefit these clubs? Yeah, definitely. And uh, for this, I would like to give a huge respect to Mr. Shola, the current CEO. I think he was very uh, savvy in, in ensuring that this partnership benefited our sites, right? So we have also a platform where the teams can log into and they can see their own data. So with this now, the teams can use that data to empirically improve their players. So coaching should not only be based off your intuition, right? You need empirical facts to say, oh, look, this player is, is, is making X amount of shots per mm -hmm. game. This player is making X, X amount, amount of, of clearances per game, mm -hmm. right? So you can begin to sh download player reports, watch highlights, share those reports to your players, right? Okay. So it's it's basically taking a Nigerian and African football to that, to the, to to that the next, next level, level using technology. Okay, so uh, Namdi, MFO, thank you so much. Uh, I think it's, it's a brilliant idea, guys. That's yeah. pretty much up to sports and data analytics for yeah. Nigerian clubs to help them improve uh, their players, improve their teams. And we'll be keeping a keen eye on the development uh, of uh, at this level of the NLO. And hopefully when you scale up to the MPFL as well, we'll definitely be in touch with you as well. Thank you so much, Namdi, for your time. We really apologize for the seemingly rushed uh, <laughs> nature of this interview, but we'll definitely have you back on the show some other time. Thank you so much, Namdi. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for having me as well. Okay.